The OP victim. The Chadland. The best victim in the game. Being super aggressive with my kit. Allowing me to survive majority of scenarios that other victims cannot survive at all. So by having these possibilities, I'm able to hopefully survive the engagements and get to an escape at any moment. Usually if my teammates don't die, that means there's a guaranteed escape on the map as I'm taking majority of the distractions or aggression from the family. Or I'm placing aggression towards them and distracting them. Either or. Whatever works. And that is my case of study with this character. And I feel like it's really good. And really enjoyable. And that's why I made him. Let's enjoy this. And the perks on the bottom right side of the screen. Go stun through doors. And stunning duration on burst grab is more by two seconds. And agitator will drop grapper's level by four levels. Which is quite nice. So we're going to get bone scrap straight away. He can make that rotation, can he? He's making it. He's making it. He's right there. Give me. Pick me. Pick me. Pick me. Pick me. Pick me. Pick me. Yes. Pick me. Thank you. I'm safe. He's breaking that door. This guy is not normal. So I'm going to try and distract this guy as much as possible. He's not normal. There's no one else there. He went this way. I'm completely safe here, by the way. He's still behind me. He's at the locker. I want to hunt him down for a bit. Stabbed. Enjoy that. I'll turn off this light and lamp too. It's my lamp. <laughs> Stabbed again. Enjoy that. Oh my god. I'm too aggressive. Stabbed again. Oh, he broke the door though. He's still stabbed. Enjoy that. Oh my god. He ain't playing. This is why I'm the best. I make the best killer on the, the enemy team, the best family member, become useless. And isn't that fun? He's losing his mind. Oh, I'm here. You want this? You want this? Come get it. Come get it. Looping like I'm playing DVD. Look, it's there by daylight. I looped him. I looped him. Oh my god. Wrong way, buddy. Oh shit. I nearly grappled. I nearly died. I nearly died. Come get it. Come get it. Come get it. <laughs> oh god. Hey, dude. Nice. No, she's here too. I've lost it. I've lost it. Wait. Recover stamina. Three, two, one. Fully. Now we got it. We're gone. We're gone. We got this. We got this. What's this? You always outplay. Play smart. You win games like it's nothing. Don't play silly. I see. Outplayed. She has no clue where I'm at at all. Darkness is key. Stealth is key. Especially with a build like this. We're going to have fun. No pots here. Oh, got one. Heal up. I hear him or I don't see him. I'm going to heal up again so I don't get one shot here. You're very nice. Did he go upstairs? That sounds like upstairs now. I hope it is, and I hope it can keep him in the basement all game. What do we have here? Well, one escape already. Well done. 
That sounds like upstairs. Now wait, don't move. Because we've got a sissy issue. If she jumps out of nowhere, where we still on recharge on ability, it could be really bad. But you see how the ability is coming together? Which is quite nice. We'll watch out for Leatherface there. Tap Gramps. Nice. Make sure he's got no level. Another player disconnected, but it's alright. It's the one that escaped. Sissy's right here. She knows where I'm going, Sissy. Interesting. Now we're in a good position. I had no clue what door they have opened, so I want to make sure that I'm safe here. But see how you play this character solo completely. You don't need to be with your team at all. You can play solo, victim, and you can become a threat. Especially with my playstyle, if you learn from this video, please do. That you can actually play like this, and it works to your advantage. But also, you can go quickly wrong if you don't know how to play like this. So that's going to be an issue too. That area is closed off. That door was never opened. It's locked, so it has to be the other side. It's car battery area. Loading dock, I believe it's what's classified. If not, it doesn't matter. I can actually do a fuse extract as well. So let's go over here. Make no noise until you have to. And that's going to happen right now for me. Self proficiency builds will help out drastically. No fuse here, sadly. This son of a gun's chasing me. We're getting some stamina. Space it. So what I'm trying to do is gain as much distance as I can during these interactions. So she doesn't apply poison on me. And I get my stamina back, see? Stun? She applied the poison though. Is that door open? It is, definitely. Boink! Enjoy that. Let's make a run for it. Fuse is over there. I can come back for the fuse here. If I need it. Lost him again. Uh, Open the door, Julie. Open the door quick. She's coming. Come on, Julie. Come on, Julie. Open the door. Open the bloody door, dude. Hell yeah. No! No! I survived. I was underneath the map. I'll distract. Good luck. Okay. Finally, they're gone. She's at the door. She's at the door. She's coming down the staircase. Loop her. Loop her for a bit. I'm turning off the gen. Or the bloody, uh, you know, battery. We got this, we got this, Julie. I'll save you, I'll make sure you're safe. Trust me. Battery's off. Is that door locked? Door's still locked. The door's locked, the door's locked. You need tool. You got one? How do we get out of here? She has one, she has one. Focus me, focus me, yes, focus me. Yes. Keep going, keep going, keep don't stop, don't stop, don't stop, keep going. I got it, I got it. Keep going, keep going. Good luck, good luck, you need it. Good luck. Keep going, keep going, get it done, get it done. Get it done, get it done, get it done. Last chance, last chance, quick! Yes! Yes! Enjoy that! Get stuck there, dude! Enjoy that! <laughs> GG! Oh god, what a play! What a play! I'm telling you, see? That is why the class is so good. The build is so good. The victim is just OP. And the best in my playstyle. So much fun. Yeah, Julie took forever. She was taking a goddamn sweet time with that door, but it doesn't matter. She gave it a smooch and they opened the door. I'm happy. And we got an escape out of it. Perfect. Had two of them chase me nonstop. The two rushes in the game with poison attacks and staggers, and we still survived. Unbelievable. Great uh, 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 showcase of the actual build. I'm just shocked how that well that went. Oh my god.
Perfect, and that's our perks. But let's showcase the build as well, because I want you guys to also use this build. We just extract from the loading dock exit, as we said. 2,300 XP. Not too bad. I'll keep that. And let's go to our customization. That is our loadout. We have Lifesaver. The actual skill tree is from here to there to actually get some stamina when we actually barge into enemy. And the cooldown is better. Perfect. The abilities are Agitator. That's why we stab Grandpa, dropping his level by four. So at any point of the game, this is a game changer against Blum builds. Then we have a stun potential increase of 3.5 seconds. I thought I still had it at two seconds. It's at 3.5. So anytime I do a backstab or close counter, 3.5 seconds. Insane. And then alongside that, we have the door slamming ability, which we didn't use too much here. But I was trying to do it towards the end with the gate. But he got stuck at the gate. And it still worked either way. And as that's uh, toughness 20. And then 8 endurance as well. Pretty much balance out the character. And it feels pretty good in that aspect. Then the skill tree that we do have is high on the right here. Left. Over here to the middle. And to this point here. That's pretty much it. All we perks are there. Good luck with the rerolls. That is one of the best victims in the game. Chadland by yours truly, Lord.